Hello, uh, my name is Dr. Theodore Brown. I'm the Dean in the School of Business and Chair of the Department of Business and Information Systems. Um, in the School of Business, this is my second year as Dean and uh, off and on, I went into my fourth year as the Chair of the Department. So we have, um, starting in 2021, we started a new part partnership with Stanford University, um, the University Innovation Fellows Program out of their um, D school or design school. And this program is a program that's um, been going on um, since around 2012. Um, last year was our first, we completed our first cohort. And it's basically a program that's global um, they have about 300, 400 students in there and um, partner institutions. And they look for um, students who have creativity um, that, that's impactful across campus, um, university, institution-wide. And it's interdisciplinary, so it doesn't um, necessarily um, tie into a major, but it's just programming, um, ideals, um, and this um, fellowship program extends even beyond the um, student's tenure at the university. The, um, the impact, the fellows program was designed to be impactful, the students to institutions. And so um, the ideals that um, come, out of, come out of the program starts with the fellow. Um, we're um, our first fellow, um, Chase Brown. Um, his, um, his ideal was dealing with um, cryptocurrency and the use of um, cryptocurrency as it relates to students um, financing their education in the academic environment. And of course, with the um, cryptocurrency and, and in the market and so forth, um, his ideal, um, he thinks that it'll be more, um, more financial advantages may come from that. It's institutions exploring crypto. My name is Chase Brown. I'm from Boston, Massachusetts. And I usually be coming to Dr. Brown's office each and every day. Uh, I really wanted to see if there's any opportunities that I could, you know, get into. And it was a good Sunday. I walked past him, you know, said hi to me, and then he was telling me, "You want to invent something?" And I said, "Sure, why not? I want to take the opportunity for this school. I'm trying to solve." The problem that a lot of people are facing with, they're facing with a lot of financial aids. And I know a lot of people um, that couldn't make it this semester due to financial aid. So with my project, I'm trying to solve that with that coin. And as I got into the market, I started to see a lot of results with that. And I genuinely thought to myself, what if I could create something in that market space? And with the fellows um, program, there's also um, provided uh, workshops for faculty on an annual basis from um, Stanford University as part of this program where um, each um, cohort are allotted two faculty slots. So in the summer, um, faculty members are, um, can be selected to faculty members and they'll spend a week at Stanford in their D school, in their design school, and there's a workshop that they'll go through on um, creativity and pedagogy and then teaching. And so we're excited about that this past year. Um, this first year was our first year that we've actually had two faculty members to go, and um, one was Dr. Um, Kenneth Lahine, um, associate professor in the Department of um, Chemistry, and. Um, and then um, Dr. Richard Blanco Toppings, who's an associate professor in the School of Business and the Business Information Department and Healthcare Administration. So we were excited about that, and we're looking forward to this upcoming year uh, where we'll be able to not only have um, more student fellows accepted, but we'll be able to take care of, take advantage of the um, D School Innovation Teaching Program for pedagogy for faculty. So there are a lot of things that uh, we're excited about with the partnerships, with recruiters coming in, and we're just, we're looking to engage the students. Um, we've got new faculty um, that's been hired, and so we're just trying to grow all of that, and we're excited about that as well for the School of Business.